Hey guys, how's it going? Octopus here, welcome back to Unicross. Well, kind of. We're gonna jump into the classic kingdom part and finally play the games. Now, I did get to try these games during the Dandelion meeting and the Kingdom Hearts 3 premiere. I got to play the food one, I forget what it's called, and a little bit of the giant one. So, we're gonna jump in, I'm gonna finally do this, get my 3,000 jewels from completing them all, and I'm gonna try them out at least once each during this video, and everything else will be after the video. Me getting my scores for the 3,000 or 600 jewels each. So, let's jump into Union Cross. you don't have to. I think if even if you're new to the game, you can just uh, go right into it, but there's an option in the in the actual settings of the game if you guys were wondering. I want to show that. And then the bottom left is Union Cross Extress. Uh, that's a weird name. Uh, they just want. I'm just gonna call it three. <laughs> so there's a three menu down there. So this is where it is. Uh, this is the second time I've been in this menu. I haven't been in here except for the video I made for the update. That's about it. But let's try these out. I have not tried the fishing frenzy. I'm gonna go with the ones that I've done before, which is Giant Land and I believe the Carnival Kid. That's what it's called. So this is the first official one I got to play during the Dandelion meeting. And uh, I didn't make a top score. They had like a little uh, event there. If you made a top score, you got special some special title in game, I think. I could be wrong, but someone got something for making top score. I believe Gilly was one of them who made top score, now that I think about it. Something happened that, saw that Gilly won. But, here we go. How to play, we don't need to know. Let's just jump in blind. So, Carnival Kid, you gotta feed everyone. You've got action controller, left, right. I was a little confused when I first played this one. Uh, I was like, how do you change the food? How do you like give it? But like the three buttons straightforward. You got the left button there, right button to go from the fold, push action, and then push up to feed it to them. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. We're about to find out. Let's start the game. Oh, this is so weird on the tablet. It feels pretty good on the tablet. Okay, he wants fries. Uh, I gotta, do I gotta? Oh yeah, that's right. That's what I was a little confused on. I gotta cook the burgers myself. So when they're at three, they're good to go, and then you push up, boom. Oh, got my burger. You want burger and fries? Boom, done. It's a it's a little fast pace. Let's start cooking burgers. You gotta make sure you're always cooking uh, hot dogs. I said burgers, didn't I? No, he wants, oh no, he wanted ketchup. See, it's so weird not having touch controls because without the touch controls there, uh, you don't feel anything. So it's, it's you're not sure if your finger's on it or not. Give it to you. I need to take that, put another one there. Calm down, boys, calm down, I'm coming. Do you want ketchup? There you go. Uh, oh no, one of those are gonna burn. One of those are gonna burn. Take that burger. Oh, did we do it? Hey, we did it, okay. <laughs> it's a little fast pace. It's very fast pace. You gotta be on point with this. Uh, lemonade, shit. Lemonade, we got this one done. Did he want ketchup? He wanted ketchup. Oh, you didn't want fries. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> No! 20 points, whatever. We'll get 20 points. We gotta cook another burger there. Uh, they just want fries with a hot dog. I'm gonna say burgers through this whole thing. I was just doing a barbecue too. I put the ketchup before I put the hot dog. I didn't even know that was a thing. Okay. We need to do all this. I need to wait for this to be ready. Come on. There we go. Give it to my boy over there. We've got just a plain burger with fries and a drink. Push that up there. What do you need there? What are you in there, Miss Minnie? Oh, you didn't want to drink? My bad, Minnie. You're going to have to wait. Donald's getting served first. He didn't want ketchup. I don't care. You're taking ketchup. You're getting ketchup now. Uh, you wanted a burger, though. Oh, shit. Okay, wait. Minnie, I'm coming. I swear. Don't leave. There you go. So they give you quite a bit of time, actually. I'm surprised by that. Get my ketchup while I can. And serve. Look at that. Yeah. All right. So far, so good. Uh, so you boy want ketchup, you want fries, ketchup on your hot dog, I got you covered. Now that I'm, I'm, I'm not panicking as much anymore, you and ketchup, there we go. Okay, we're getting the groove now. You want ketchup, just a hot dog, that's how I like it, my girl's simple. I want fries, a drink, let me cook another one, give it to you, I need ketchup on this dog, uh, get a drink, pop that to my boy Donald right there. There you go, you can tell I'm a better state of mind right now. Uh, throw that up there. Who else wants to drink and just a dog? Drink and just a dog? I got you covered. I got you covered. Uh, you want ketchup and fries? I got you. Ketchup and a burger? I mean a hot dog? I got you covered as well. Uh, you want fries with a burger? I mean a hot dog? Oh my god, how many times am I going to say burger here? Uh, you just want a drink and you do want ketchup. Alright. So, there we go. I'm surprised I'm making it this far. Do we have like a life or something? Or should I just keep going? 
I can't even tell right now. Uh, who wanted fries and ketchup? You wanted fries and ketchup. There you go. Yeah, just fries and ketchup. I swear I grabbed that burger. Did I grab it? There. Nobody wants a drink. You just want ketchup on it? I got you. I like the simple things in life. Uh, grab that, grab that, grab you a drink. There you go. Who wants just a burger and everything? You're very simple over here. I'll take you. Gotta make that, that, fries. Come on. Cook it up. Cook, 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 cook. Yeah. Who else we got here? You want ketchup on yours and a drink? Served. You just want a hot dog? Served. What else you guys need there? You want fries and a drink and all that good stuff? Ooh, I got you covered. I got you covered. Someone wants a plane with a drink? Aw, oh, time ran out. Is that my score? 2028? Okay, I think that's my score. Let's go back and see what happens. 2028 on the first one, guys. There you go, my first try. Um, well, I have to give up, isn't that? Yeah, that's all, that's all over. All right, 2028, quitting. So, my goal is 30,000? You're just gonna have to spend a long time here. You're just gonna have to spend a long time here. So that was the first one I ever got to play um, all the way back at Dying Lion Meeting, and then this is the one I got to try at the premiere. So, Giant Lion, Sora starts on the bottom right. You gotta run up his legs, go across, open the window, and then jump over him. This one's pretty straightforward. It's all about facts action. But like I was saying, it's really hard to talk and play at the same time. But because the screen's flat, you have no button there, so you lose your fingers very, very quickly. So it's kind of hard for that. I don't, I'm not a fan of like touchscreen buttons. It's very weird. I'd rather put like some kind of nipples on here so I could feel where these buttons are. So if I got like suction cups I can sit on here, it'd probably be a little bit better. I probably could do that. You could probably take that out of old uh, controls and stuff like that. That was little bouncy sticker things. Uh, but we'll talk about that another time. Okay, here we go. This is straightforward. I'm surprised my Elgato has no delay on it. Really good right now. Ooh, brave man, brave man. Here I go. There you go. Burn me up. Nope. So the pepper here is what knocks you up in the air. And then you gotta push action to jump on the next chandelier. And then action again so Mick can grab your hand. So there you go. First stage done. Whoa. Sometimes you take a chance. Like it's not a bad idea to take a chance sometimes. It's gonna get harder and harder and harder from this point on. Like you can see, you can sit right beside his hand. Like I should just went there. There, oh, if I was a little click quicker, I could have made it. But you can see how the timing is a lot faster now. And this is only round two. Oh, I just jumped down. Okay, at least I still have all my free men. That's a thing. Nope. Three, two, and one now. There you go, perfect. And I should be able to grab this one. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay, three, two, one. Here you go. I got to wait for the other one to come. Come on, chandelier. I think it's this one here. I could have done that one. I actually could have done that one. But this one's for sure here. Here we go. That was only stage two. That was only stage two. Holy shit. Ooh. Sword just got crushed. Okay, you might be able to rush that one. But if you're just quick enough. Nope, got crushed again. Got crushed again. But it, it's pretty straightforward. You take a chance, don't take a chance. Or just wait it out. Be patient and you'll make it further and further. I should be patient. But I'm not a patient man sometimes. You guys will see that on my playthroughs when I play any game. I'll take a lot of risk. I didn't even know his fist would go there. Whatever. Done and done. Done and done. We I've done this one before. Uh, I guess just for the update video. So two is the furthest I've made it so far. It's not hard. It's just once you learn how fast he goes and the rhythm, it's fine. There's no speed to it. So you don't have to go super, super fast. You just take your time. It's one of those games if you have a lot of patience, you'll make it. Uh, if you do it two times every time, you got to do it 25 times. If you do one time each time, you got to play this game 50 times. So there you go. So now it's the ones I haven't played at all. So let's go for the musical farmer. I've seen gameplay on this and I'm not looking forward to this one. This one is it's a lot harder because you got to go up, down, left, right. You got to collect eggs, make sure the eggs don't smash, turn the pipes. Wait, there's game A and game B. Wait, is there two difficulties? I see an egg in the middle and I see an egg. Okay, well, there's two difficulties. Let's go for the harder one. Game A, I guess. All right, uh, A coming up from over there. So this is up and that's down. Okay, I got you. Nice and slow right now. We're going to switch that one over. So once you watch the eggs on the bottom, all you got to pay attention to the next eggs falling. So you see the next eggs falling, you just change it. So right now, I just got to sit here. I got to empty baskets. So you might as well empty baskets as the eggs come in. 
because the baskets can only hold up to three eggs, I believe. So once three eggs are there, you're pretty much done. The middle one is just there for... Oh, no! Shit! I could have turned it. I could have turned it because nothing was coming from the left. So I could have done... Oh, no, you can't. Oh, you can't have it so only the left pipe is closed? All right, that kind of sucks. You might as well empty the basket if it's taking that long. Oh, shit. There we go. That one's turning. Now we can turn that one. Everything's safe over here. Nothing's coming from the middle pipe. So as soon as the eggs go down, I guess you can just go for it. Yeah, there you go. Somehow when the eggs come together into the tunnels, they don't smash. This is kind of boring. Like, I know it's probably going to get super, super fast later on. But, yeah. I guess this is a thing. There it is. There it is. Third one. Come on, drop in the basket. There we go. Oh. I guess I won. Look how happy the hens are up there. <laughs> this one's going to stress me. Wait a minute. Oh, I guess the game chooses. The game chooses for you. So if the, they come from the left, you're not going to get screwed over. I was like, how am I supposed to open the tunnel for that one? But there you go. It's pretty straightforward right now. So the basket in the middle, I need to like switch it up. So if this comes all three... Okay, there's three coming down there. So two eggs drop in here. I'm just going to pop it. It's going to just going to pop it right in. Go ahead. Boom. Done. Wait, an egg fell? Where did that egg fall from? I didn't even see that. All right. I guess. Oh, no. We got two out of ten. We're still here. We're still here. It just switches the eggs. Oh, that's how that one works. Okay. Okay. I really don't like this one, guys. Oh, I really don't like this one. But well, we're going to get through it. Get your egg in the basket, please. There we go. As soon as the egg comes, I'm just dropping it. I think it's going to be better as you go to higher... F Wait, what? What am I missing here? What am I missing here? <laughs> Alright, I'm going to give this another chance. Alright, I think I'm going to just try to figure it out. Because I feel like there's going to be tricks in here. So we're going to go game A. Because game A actually has three baskets. Game B only has two baskets. And you got to switch the one to the left or the right to collect the eggs. I'd rather just focus. So, I think the baskets down below aren't too important they hold up to three eggs which is totally fine so we're going to pay attention more to the tunnels and then as soon as the baskets have like two eggs in it it's gone it's going i'm not even going to take a chance so let's just manage the top and focus on the bottom like i want to like the game but my god it's got a lot of positions okay all right so you can scoop the egg some people on discord were telling me you could scoop the egg which is a huge help like as soon as it drops right there boom scoop that egg Oh, I didn't know it was the top one. I don't know. Oh, there's actually a little green pipe there. You can actually see that it's blocked off. Or at least I think that means it's blocked off. Or it could just be part of one of the curves there. Um, okay. We screwed up the first one. No, it's not blocked off. It's 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 just part of the game. It, I'm, I'm wrong. I'm completely wrong. Okay. I got to pay attention to this part right here. The egg's inside. There we go. We switched it. That's all that's important right now. Uh, eggs are all safe. Eggs are all safe. You just don't want to lose your free men. So as long as everything's looking pretty crisp right now, one there. Nope, that was too early. There we go. Grab those two eggs in there. One egg in the basket, one flow in the air. Magical. There we go. I'm actually getting somewhere this time. All right. Pay attention, Sor. Pay attention, man. Don't let the eggs die. Here we go. We're going to keep it like this just for now. Middle eggs coming in. Oh, no. Middle one's coming in. Okay. Everything's clean right now. Every tunnel looks like it's going down perfectly. Got no issues, just got to collect the eggs. I think once it goes a little faster, I won't mind too much, but eh, I don't find much joy in this. Watching eggs fall. Yeah, 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 let's move those two together. Grab that egg in the air, boom. Egg in the basket, egg in the air, boom. Oh, no. Oh, oh the other side. See, that's the hardest part. It's just watching the top. Just watching the top is the hardest part. All right, I had enough of this. I'm good. You're good, right? We're good. Let's jump into the next one. So the only other ones we haven't done is the Barnyard Battle and Fishing Frenzy. Let's go Barnyard Battle and see how that goes. All right, Barnyard Battle. We got two sides. Sora hits left or right. Mickey hits left or right. Pretty self-explanatory. Now, if I hit without anyone being there, is it a punishment? No. So you guys got to be really good for this. This might be a little bit of difficulty for the nerve damage I have in my right arm. Oh, you have to do it perfect timing. Yeah, I might have an issue with this. Well, we'll see how good I do with the nerve damage. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. 
So as long as I don't just, like, boom, perfect. The noise is pretty consistent, so as long as you pay attention to the noise. Noise. So far, so good. Is that supposed to be Pete? That is Pete. Is that Pete on the right, too? Is that something else? Double hit! Double kill! There we go. So far, not too bad. Oh shit. I did it too early. Oh, okay. I got two more lives. Let's pull this off. Yeah, I can, feel, I can feel the difficulty in this. Let's see if I can pull it off. This might not be too hard for you guys. This one seems pretty simple. It's just a little too hard for me. Until I get used to it. Like, I gotta get really comfortable with it. And eventually, uh, it's not an issue. So once I get comfortable with it, I'll figure it out. I just gotta do it differently. Okay. Left side. Sora's got it. There we go, there we go, there we go. Who's this one? Are they all Peach? Just in, like, different costumes? Ooh. I feel like I'm playing DDR right now. Well, it'd be a little bit slow right now. <laughs> it'd be one of the slower songs. Okay, left. Here we go. My eye, my hand-eye coordination is still working. E. That's how I'm doing critical mode right now. I'm birth by sleep. There we go. Oh, I thought that would be a full round. Oh, it's getting faster. It's getting faster. I like it. I like it. I wonder if the Algados give me a delay. I'm still questioning that. Like, should I trust the Algado at the moment? Ooh. I like these kind of games, though. I love games like this where you go by the rhythm. Not the rhythm, but, like, your timing, your reflexes. Really love these kind of games. Yeah, this is like a hand DDR. I'm pretty sure they have a game that's like a hand DDR. Ooh. I love these. There we go. I'm like holding my breath for a second there. Is that a new kind of Pete there? It looks like it. Nice. So far, so good. Oh, they jump over the thing now. I saw that. He jumped over. Oh, okay, I really like this one. I really like this one. They added more to it. Oh, no. I got confused with the right and the left one. Okay, I think it was my last life. I got a score of 1,151. Pete got Mickey. Ah, uh, rip Mickey. Sora's okay, though. That's all that matters. So I got 1,151, and the score is 25,000. So this is just going to take time. That's it. All right, last one, Fishing Frenzy, which I never got to see until um, somebody showed me, and also that it, uh, it came out for this, pretty much. So Fishing Frenzy. Uh, there's fish on top. There's fish on stairs. There says no fishing. So I'm pretty sure I'm just supposed to grab the fishes. But what about the up? Do I have like a, a hook for the ones on the top? We'll see. We'll see. I did a little bit of fishing in Newfoundland. I think it was called... Uh, oh, is that it? I think it was called uh, when you put just a string and a hook down. Oh, I need to pull them up. Okay, dodge the big fishes. So here we go. I grab that fish and then pull it up and while dodging the big guys, right? Oh, you really got to pull up. Can you just hold it? Okay, you can just hold it if you want to. There you go. You don't have to keep clicking the button over and over and over again. So just hold it down. But I think pushing it down makes it go faster. Oh, I didn't even know the giant fish on top. Didn't even notice him. Here, we got a little guy. Let's hold the button. Okay, so for up, just hold it. Down, I would push it down yourself. Shit. It's so slippery. Okay. I want to try this one more time. I like this one. I kind of like this one. I like the the barnyard one better. There we go. We grabbed him. Let's go to safety and reel him up. Boom. Okay, let's go down here. Grab him while we can. Go in safety. Hold it up. Can we just... You could. I think tapping's probably a little bit faster for both ways up and down. Might as well grab this little guy while we're at, while we're at it. And get ready for this guy. So you got to line it up on exactly where the fish is. There you go. Get out of the way. Reel that up. I think you might... I should test the holding and everything. Holding seems good enough. You guys don't have to tap it. Holding seems good enough. So, so far, so good. Get the little guy out of there. Let's jump over here. <laughs> he almost got me. They're getting faster. They're getting a lot faster. I wonder if you're pulling something up, it has a chance to get you. Oh, there's the no fishing signs. Here's where the difficulty comes in. Here we go. Got it. Now, does that sign hit my fish and stop the fish? It hasn't happened yet, but I wonder if that's a thing. Might as well grab the little guy where we're waiting. Run across. Get that down. Oh, yeah. This also has... They're all just five fast uh, reaction times, but, like, I like this one, too. Barnyard and this one so far has been my favorite. 
Um, the, the egg one sucks. My god, does it ever suck. Here we go. Safe spot. We're in a safe spot. We're at 500 so far, guys. 500 so far, I think. So we got to make a score of 670. Whoa, they're coming so much faster right now. Let's grab this one over here. Yeah, look how fast the dead, the, the, the sh teeth shark. I don't like to call them. I'm just going to call them sh fish sharks. Grab a little one. Get those little points. They're only worth 10. How much are you worth? Oh, get out of the way. We're at 600. I wonder if I can grab that guy in time. No, I didn't grab him in time. Okay, this one's not too bad. This one is pretty much just watch for the big guys up there and eventually a fish will come to you. Since there's no timer, the scariest thing is above you. That's it. Score is 670. I like these. I like that they also added this to Union Cross. Like, because this is going to be in Kingdom Hearts 3. So it's nice that we got like a little sneak peek of what's to come. I'm really curious about the other ones. Can I just move across and grab the fish? Hold on, hold on. Let's try to get out of the way real quick. Oh, I can see where the difficulty is going to come in. I see it now. You're right across the water. Yeah, okay, I can move the boat with the, with the hook sticking out and just... Oh, no, you can't. You got to wait for it. I was thinking if the hook was down you moved the boat, you would have grabbed it anyways. But no, that didn't work out. Shit. They are super fast. Okay, last life, last life. Now this is where the challenge comes in. Oh, I went right into it. I was going to go into it and back. But all right. 840 for the fishing frenzy. Uh, beat my first time. And all you need is 7,500. So I got 950 already. So these are pretty cool. Um, definitely my all-time favorite here is fishing frenzy. And the barnyard battle. I think I like the barnyard battle the most. The most out of all this. Uh, the carnival kid is... It, it's very... You got to be very, very quick for this one. Um, so you got to pay attention to what's going on, making sure that the, the hot dogs don't burn, make sure you don't put ketchup by accident. I would really prefer this game if it was actual buttons. Um, this one would be pretty good. This one, this one can burn <laughs> for all I care. This one is no. This is a big no here. I think eventually if uh, I got good at it, but it's so slow to start off with and then it goes into a fast pace that you would never really catch a proper rhythm unless you played hours and hours of this. So I, I really don't like that one. This one's cool. I like it just because of Giant Lion. It looks great. It's uh, it's like a lot of the ones I used to play when I was a kid. I had like a Ninja Turtle one. I had a Star Trek one. I had a lot of ones from McDonald's as well. I think it was McDonald's I gave them out or Burger King, one or the other. But I used to have games like this uh, handheld. If I ever find them, I'll show them to you guys. But too late for that now. So definitely, definitely top two favorites is number one, Barnyard, Fishing Frenzy, and then Giant Land. With Carnival Kid being a fourth and this not even existing at all to me it doesn't exist please don't be super important for kingdom hearts 3 like i have to get some ori calcum off it or something but that is the class in kingdom games i can finally do it get my six thousand jewels oh three thousand jewels for both accounts i had to do it for two i did i had to do this twice guys if i want three thousand jewels and the code i guess i have a free code later on down the line i could probably do a giveaway if someone that really doesn't want to do these i can do a giveaway for you guys if you want uh, make a couple accounts, get a couple codes, and give it to people who miss it or something. I don't know. Who sees? I have two accounts. One's my wife, one's mine. Obviously, she doesn't play, so I have an extra code sitting around. We'll see what happens, guys. Anyways, if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to hit the like button. Uh, down in the comments, let me know what one is your favorite, which one's your least favorite, even though I'm pretty sure we're all going to agree. Well, the majority is going to agree on that uh, one that doesn't... The one we don't speak of. <laughs> As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Keep on smiling, and I'll see you in the next one.